Okay, as I told you guys, I will be showing you guys how to take some of your holiday leftovers and make something really special with them. Um, I decided to do macaroni and cheese bites. Why? Because on the holidays, we always make a bit too much macaroni. So instead of making it go to wet, letting it go to waste, I'm sure you guys have kids, I'm sure you guys have movie night, TV night, whatever. These would be great little snacks to go ahead and chop really together really while I. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Welcome to Rita's Kitchen. Today I've decided to show you guys how to make my version of braised short ribs topped with a red wine glaze. This is how tender it should be. Look how nicely that's pulling away. How juicy it is in that glaze. And that's some really good stuff. So now we are gonna get ready to plate and I wanna just let you guys know braised beef short ribs, voila. Welcome to Rita's Kitchen. Today we're gonna to be doing ground chicken stuff, ground chicken stuff cabbage, voila. Welcome to Rita's Kitchen. Today I've decided we're going to do a trio stuff portobello cap mushroom. First one is going to be a spinach and cheese. Second one is going to be a crab stuffed mushroom. The third one will be a pasta stuffed mushrooms. All will be topped with cheese. So this is what I'm dealing with. So now what we're gonna do is start stuffing these things. Um, of course, again, they're huge. Mushrooms do sink dry, right? So how do you make that moist to be able to make a good stuff mushroom? So you want to just, I will grease mine up with a little olive oil. Pour them things up. The spinach stuff, the crab, and the mushroom. Then we're gonna to top them with some more cheese. That's deliciousness. Trio stuffed portobello cap mushrooms, voila. Thank you. 